Pull. Pull, quick pull, hide. It doesn't apply to potatoes, pie face. Classmates, I hope you'll all be voting for me to be this year's class prefect. <laughs> we wouldn't vote for you if you were the only kid standing. <laughs> and you are the only kid standing. No one else wants that boring job. Boring? I think not. Helping teachers clean school rules is what I was born to do. Then tell him, Walter. Fit for Walter! Fit for Walter! Ah, Sausage and Mash Monday! Oh, but you're Ban Nasher! Unless. <laughs> Genius wears a striped jumper! One bite for me. Ow. And one for you. You need a haircut, Dennis. School rules say hair should be no more than ten centimetres long. Huzzah! Oh, lucky me! Stop! Broken in 30 seconds, Dennis. That's a record even for you. Hey, no hair over 10 centimetres, no pets in school. What's the third one? No sausages flung into the teacher's mouths between 1 and 2 on a Monday afternoon. How am I supposed to know that? <laughs> it's in the rule book. Learn them all tonight, or it's detention every day until you do. Brilliant! I bet there's rules in here that I haven't even dreamed of breaking. Ah. Rule 409, no fat powder in the dinner hall. Rule 410, no skydiving in assembly. <laughs> you sing just like Walter. <laughs> Listen to this. Rule 411, the class prefect gets to bring a pet to school. It's a really old rule made so Lord Beanoworth's son could bring his tiger to class. Hold on a sec. If you were prefect, you could bring your pet to school. Nash, nash, nasha. Yeah, but then I'd have to be the teacher's pet. <laughs> Anyway, I've got a much better idea. Time for Plan D and G. Voting is today, so if nobody else wants to be class prefect... Prepare to grovel my subjects. Uh, um, I mean, uh, I graciously accept. Hang on, there's someone else who wants to stand for class prefect. You? I'd rather eat a cactus. <laughs> Dennis can't stand as class prefect. The rules say prefects can't have had more than five detentions. He's had 500. Which is why our candidate is... Paul! A potato? No, 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 Dennis. That is a pet. No pets in school. Well, you said yesterday that rule didn't apply to Paul. Then it's time to change the rules. But, Headmaster, the rule is nonsense. He's a potato, a spud. A chip. <gasps> There's nothing in the school rule book that says potatoes can't stand for class prefect. Enough, all of you. Clearly, we need to change the rules to disallow vegetables. Thank you, Headmaster. A triumph for common sense. But the rules say school rules can only be changed by a majority vote at a school meeting on the third Tuesday after a full moon, provided there's a J in the month. What is Stupid system! Can we change it? Well, yes, but only by a majority vote on the third Tuesday... So what you're saying is there's nothing to stop Paul standing for class prefect? Oh, it seems not. Don't worry, miss. I'm fairly confident I can beat a root vegetable. Very well. May the best man... Or potato. Or potato win. <laughs> <laughs> Walter, I'm efficient, respectable, and a stickler for rules. What more could you want? How about a bit of fun? Let's <laughs> put an end to Walter's waffle by voting for Paul. <laughs> no bikes in school, and any candidate who breaks school rules is immediately disqualified. 
Ha! The potato's out! I win! Ha! But Paul didn't break any rules. He's over there. Hello. Detention, both of you. <laughs> Don't worry, Nasha. Detention's a small price to pay. When Paul wins, he's bringing a pet to school. And that's going to be you. <laughs> Nasha! Aha! Uh -huh. You're trying to ruin my campaign so you can bring your stupid dog to school. Not at all, Walter. It's just that Paul's clearly the better candidate. <laughs> Nonsense. What on earth is a potato good for? <laughs> Town School. I'm asked to name one thing a potato is good for, and I give you chips for your fish, mash for your sausages, jackets for your cheese and beans. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I'm clearly a better candidate. For one thing, I'm smarter than a potato. <laughs> oh, really? What? Six times five times four times three times two times one times zero. Uh, oh, uh, carry the one. Uh, oh. Psh, rubbish. But Paul got it right. What? Paul said nothing. And nothing is the correct answer. <laughs> <laughs> Paul's a better athlete than you two. Oh, what nonsense. I bet you he can reach the end of the playground before you can. You'll run on three. Three! <laughs> I'd like to see a potato get there before me. Potato three, Walter nil. I've had enough of this. I'm turning you into mash. <laughs> Totally, utterly ludicrous! It's a potato! A potato! Do you want all the other classes to laugh at us? Thankfully, sanity prevails! That prefect badge is mine! Psst. Looks like we'll have to rely on our top secret plan after all! Yeah. Something. Let me see. See what? You mean these plans? I yeah. wouldn't do that if I were you, Walter. You'd need the agility of a cat to get up there. And you've got the agility of an elephant. Hmm. The agility of a cat, eh? <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I knew he'd fall for it. <laughs> Walter! I'm shocked! These are plans for cheating to win the election! Walter! These are not mine! But I caught you red-handed! Literally! And, miss, isn't bringing your pet into school against the rules? And aren't rule breakers disqualified, miss? Hmm. Walter, maybe you're not a perfect prefect after all. What? No! <laughs> oh, dear. Looks like there's only one candidate left, miss. So, we have a clear winner. Your new class prefect is Paul the Potato. Oh! Yeah! Give it up for Prefect Paul! Woo! <laughs> you know this is only till they get the rules changed. Yeah, but it'll be fun while it lasts. Speaking of which... Everyone say hello to the class prefect's pet. <laughs> oh, you horrible hound. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be a bad loser, Walter. You didn't stand a chance against Team Menace. <laughs> Yes! Another 
a great save by the Nashmeister. Huh? Oops. Smash, smash. Oh, smashing kick, Dennis. <laughs> I would describe that as a penalty kick, as the window's going to cost you... A whole year's pocket money. <laughs> what? No way. You know, Dennis, soccer takes sportsmanship, skill, control. Uh, give me back my ball, Walter. All of which I have. It's not about running around with a rubbish goalie like him. <laughs> rubbish? He's the best goalie there is. You'd never get one past Nasher. Oh, please. I could win against you in that mangy mutt any time, Dennis. OK, then. This Friday, my team versus yours. And winner pays for the window. You're on. By the way, I'm keeping hold of this in case you or it causes any more damage. Couldn't have put it better myself, B. <laughs> Operation Menace match of the day. Empty your pockets. Right, it's a three-a-side game, so I'm centre forward. Nash is in goal. Curly, you're in defence. <laughs> what about me? Right, uh, you're the uh, the manager, of course. Oh, <laughs> all right then, lads. It's a game of two halves, but at the end of the day, we play to win and uh, beat Walter. <laughs> yeah, we've got a smash Walter's defences. Oh. <gasps> Don't say mash. Paul's lost some of his best friends to mash. Smash, pie face, not mash. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we've lost you too, pie face. <laughs> 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 Bertie, my house. Bring Dudley and bring sausages. Sausages? Yes, sausages. <laughs> Dennis! Dennis! Show up some madness! Hooray! Hooray! Let's play some jolly good football today! Captains, over here, please! I'd just like to point out that I'm not just captain, I'm also club manager, coach, CEO, and a turnip. Who has the ball? I do, referee. Hey, that's my ball! Let's get this match underway! What's going on, Nasha? Get back in goal! <laughs> foul! Foul! Ref! Ref! Indeed! A heinous misdemeanor has been committed! According to the official rules of Grudge Match Football in the Park, their team's disqualified. Game over. Uh, hello? Are you the referee? Do you have a whistle? Are you in charge? No, I'll say when the game is over. I'll give you one more chance. New ball, please. <laughs> oh, no, not again. Nasha. Aww. Dennis's team disqualified. Yes! We are the champions! We are the champions! We are the champions! We are the champions! What's got into Nasha? Bangers! What he means is a bang goes your chance of winning. Nasha, what's got into you? <laughs> oh. <laughs> And here is the invoice for the repair to our window. Do pay promptly. Dad gave me that ball for Christmas. <laughs> what is it, Nasha? <laughs> what? This smells like sausages. Time to call in the experts. I smell a foul. Menace Substation 3. What's up, Dennis? I need you at Menace HQ. Emergency code red. <sighs> oh, that's sneaky. That's very sneaky. Take a look at this, Dennis. 
See the tiny particles of sausage meat all over the material? Who'd want to make a sausage-flavoured football? Someone who wanted Nasha to destroy the football and lose the game. Walter! Walter. Rematch tomorrow. Why on earth would I agree to a rematch? Because if you don't, I'll tell everyone you cheated. <laughs> <laughs> we can't do that again. But how else could we beat them? Nasha's way too good at goal. Don't you worry about that dopey dog. I'm going to make sure they get disqualified for good this time. Uh, uh, are they? Nasha's? Nasha's? These? No, they're my granddad's false teeth. I'm going to fix them to look just like Nasher's. They don't stand a chance. <laughs> ah. Now, is it clear who's in charge of this match, Walter? <laughs> Marks, you mean? Ugh, Nash has been nowhere near the ball. Uh, nash, nash, nash. Anyone have another ball? No. 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 Then it's game over. Meaning my team are still the winners. <laughs> oh dear, Dennis, you must feel so uh, deflated. <laughs> Stop! Dad, bring B. Pie face, get your beaniest pies. Ref, just give me that. <laughs> Kit, please. Well, I'm very impressed, Dennis. You can't allow this, Ref. Well, I'm sorry, Walter, but I'll bet there's not a single word about farting babies inflating footballs in the rules. <laughs> this isn't potty training. This is the beautiful game. Or what I call the beautiful game. Okay then, game on. <laughs> Well done, son. Put it there. Nasha, mate, come here. Huh? Uh, 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 <laughs> Two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate? Nasha, Nasha. I'm Baby B. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like I won't be needing this bill for a new window after all. <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. 
nobody gets in that door. Dennis, we're going on a family holiday whether you like it or not. Please, Mum. I can't take another holiday at Auntie Prue's. <laughs> Please, Auntie Prue, 500 star trumps before breakfast. It's too much! Nonsense! You need to earn your wheat jump porridge. Now, put your backs into it, spit spot! <laughs> Don't worry, we're not going back to Auntie Prue's. We've managed to find a holiday camp you haven't been banned from. And there's loads of activities to keep you out of our hair. I, I mean, happy. Hmm. Adventure playgrounds, archery targets, scavenger hunts, fun, fun, fun from dawn till dusk. <laughs> Sounds brilliant! Let's get packing, Nasha! Nash, nash, nash. Now look, son. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Saves me taking it down. Are we there yet? For the five hundredth time, no! Ugh. Try and enjoy the country here. Insert pipe K into slot nine. <laughs> Taking care not to... Can I check out the campsite, Dad? Of course you can. Soon as you get your tent up. <laughs> That'll keep him quiet for a bit. <laughs> All done. I'll be back for tea. See ya. <laughs> hey! Welcome to Camp Sunshine. I'm Billy, your crazy camp host. <laughs> okay. I'm looking for fun. Am I right? I'll show you the way and let you start relaxing. Oh. <laughs> And here's our activity tent. Now, you don't want grown-ups cramping your style, am I right? So, I've left it all in the capable hands of my favourite nephew. Cool. <laughs> Walter! Yes! I see your mum got the leaflet. <laughs> she told me all about Auntie Prue's and I couldn't bear to think of you having another terrible time on your holidays. Yes! Right then, I'll leave you to get on with it then, shall I? <laughs> bye bye for now. Cool archery. <laughs> Felt it pens, so we can do some fun colouring in, of course. Colouring in. What about archery? Oh no, Dennis, that's far too dangerous. We're exploring the creative arts. Creative, eh? Stay within the lines. Hmm. Don't forget the uh... oh, no! <laughs> bullseye. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in charge here. Oh, if you want to stay, you have to oh, to do what I tell you. Oh. Maybe I don't want to stay. What? Would you rather go back to Auntie Prue's? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing like a bracing ice cold char. That. <laughs> Nash. Okay, maybe it is better here. Just. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. Of course it is. You'll find my activities a perfect blend of healthy exercise and educational fun. <laughs> to the adventure playground. <laughs> That's more like it. <laughs> More like it. We should be climbing it, not cleaning it. And mess it up with your muddy feet? Not likely. <laughs> more water. We need more water. Whatever you say, Walter. <laughs> about it, you'll have to leave. And we both know what that means. 
Uh, can't I have some lemonade, Auntie? Nonsense. Prunzels is good for you. <laughs> ah, this holiday's turning into a real washout. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello, son. Ready for some beans and sausages? Proper camping food. Hey, hey! Everyone's having a lovely time. <laughs> Am I right? Yes. Yes. Walter said you weren't settling in. He thought you may be happier on holiday somewhere else. Auntie Prue's, was it? <laughs> oh, behave! Oh, behave! Tell you what, there's a scavenger hunt tomorrow. Yeah! Why don't you take part and see for yourselves that a Camp Sunshine holiday is the best holiday in the whole wide world. <laughs> Am I right? Oh, I love my job. <laughs> Dennis, please find a way to get along with Walter before he gets us all kicked out. And before we have to go and stay with Auntie Prue. Oh, <laughs> It's going to be all right. Oh, I'm not letting Walter ruin our holiday. Time for Plan D and G. <laughs> Morning. I've made breakfast. Are you feeling all right? Of course. Why don't the two of you go for a nice early morning walk? I'll look after B. <laughs> like Dad says, Proper camping food. Up your hungry bee. <laughs> They're the best scavenger list ever. Those beans brewing yet, bee? <laughs> <laughs> now to print it out. Oh, what is that pong? <laughs> Keep watch, Nasha. This list a bit more interesting. <laughs> Genius wears a striped jumper. Nice, nice. <laughs> now, where was I? Oh, yes. <laughs> Are simple. Like you, eh, Walter? <laughs> <laughs> Silence! Collect as many items on my list as you can. But beware, many of them are rather surprising. He's not wrong there. Nash, Nash! Uncle Billy and I will judge the winner when you get back. On your marks, get set, scavenge! <laughs> 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 Scavenger hunts, Walter. I put loads of fun items on this year. <laughs> uh, my megaphone! Hey, wh what are you doing with that? <laughs> it was on Walter's list. Look, let me see that. A, a red toilet roll, five points. Bareface cheek. Uh, a hot dog sausage, ten points. My dinner more like. A pair of polka dot pants, a hundred points. All the tent pegs you can carry, ten points each. <laughs> but I don't understand. It's chaos back there. Who told you what to pull up our tent pegs? <laughs> Sorry, Walter. It seems you can't be trusted to be in charge. Am I right? Yes! Hey, kids! Who would you like in charge? Yes! I can't hear you! Yes! Well, looks like we have a winner. Am I right? Yes! I'm not wrong. Time for some proper fun. Colouring in the archery targets. Huh? Style. Hooray! Uh, hang on, Walter. Someone has some tent pegs to replace. Am I right? No. Oh, cheer up, Walter. We're on holiday. Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Ha, <laughs> ha,
<laughs> Sorry, didn't see you there, Dennis. Oh, wait. Yes, I did. Uh -huh. Oh, you're toast, Walter! <laughs> This week, miss. It's Monday, and you've been late every day this term. The rest of you aren't much better either, except for you, Walter, 100%. Perhaps people would make more effort if there was a proper punishment for being late, miss. <sighs> You're right, Walter. Anyone late for school this week won't be going to be no town fair. Aha! Aha! Quiet! <laughs> Make Walter late for school. How? He's never been late for anything in his life. There's no way Dennis is coming on that trip. Whatever it takes, I'm going to make him late for school. Uh, isn't he always late for school anyway? Shut up, Bertie. Shut up, Walter. Yeah. <laughs> I think I may have an idea. to move that brick. Stop his car? There's no other way. You got a better idea? Mm. What do you think, Payface? Look, I glued Paul so he can have a swing. Cool. And um, how are you going to get him off again? Easy, I'll just put... <laughs> Paul, what have I done? Huh? He won't fall for the window trick again. We need to think of something new. Right. Think, think, think. Think, think, think. Heave! Heave! Aha! I have it! Remove that brick.
Important, don't you think, Miss? Unless you're Dennis, of course. Unfortunately, Mrs. Creature has banned me from using the helicopter again, but no matter. With this transmitter, I'm going to know all Dennis's pranks in advance. Pie face! How's a um, uh, potato thingy? Oh, he's still quite sore. Oh, dear. Maybe this will help. Wow, thanks, Walter. He wants to say thank you himself. Go on, Paul. Don't be shy. Hmm. We need to find something to distract him. What does Walter really care about? Guys, I think Paul's going to make it. <gasps> That's it. Walter loves his pet cat. So what I'm thinking is... <laughs> for school if he thinks Claudius is missing. <coughs> Cat biscuits, Nasha. Nash, Nash, Nash. I've got you this time, Dennis the Menace. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> nash, 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 nash. <laughs> Brilliant! Claudius has taken the biscuit bait. <laughs> 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 Once again, Genius wears a striped jumper. Uh, Nasha? <laughs> oh, thanks, Dennis. Claudius loves these. <laughs> Don't be too late for school. Nasha! One. Hey, Nasha. Boy! <laughs> Get him, Nasha! Nasha, Nasha, Nasha! Nasha, Nasha, Nasha! Menacing. Uh, 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 uh. Look on the bright side, miss. We're not late for school. to do that. You both all right? No, Dennis. We've both got... <coughs> we've both got... <coughs> I mean, we've both got... That's all right, Payface. What he's trying to say is that we've both got... <coughs> we've both got... 
Buff got what? Oh, Curly, Pie Face, didn't you get the letter? The Beano Town cold is so contagious that you must stay home. And you, dog? <coughs> yes, you, dog. You aren't allowed here. Pie Face, Curly, dog, you must all leave the school grounds this instant. <coughs> Yeah, I, I think I might be coming down with something. Inside! <sighs> quiet! Quiet, class! Quiet! No more chattering, everyone! Quiet! Quiet! Oh, looks like quite a few pupils have the cold. Not I, Mrs Creature. <laughs> I'm perfectly well. Walter, didn't you get the letter? I don't have a cold, Mrs. Creature. I am 100% healthy. Now then, class, if James has 37 counters in his left hand and 92 counters in his right hand, how many hands does he have? Walter. Jumping at the shape of the people. See a rainbow, should A good try, Walter. Next question. Dennis, what is the square root of a million times the square root of a billion? Uh, is it nine? Oh, hopeless, Dennis. Hopeless. <laughs> yeah, Dennis. Oh. Walter, call me crazy, but I think you may be ill. I'm having your parents pick you up. No, Walter. This could be the best school day ever. <laughs> Just a dessert for my lunch, Bren. How much? Not many children in, so they're free today. Oh. Well, in that case, uh, I'll only have 50 of them. Oh, no. Headmaster's orders. One dessert per child. But I'm the only... Strict instructions. Want your dessert, then? Uh, sure. Can I have a spoon? Yeah. Actually, forget the spoon. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, bonjour. I am the French exchange student, Pierre Le Bonbon. La dessert, please. All right, but you only get one. Merci. Hang on. Oh, guten hello. I am German exchange student Fritz von Munich. A dessert, please say thank you. Uh, are there many kids in that lunch line? Oh, ja, ja. Why don't you take a look? <laughs> yeah, I knew it. You're not getting one over on me. Oh, may have overdone it on dessert. Come on, bowler. <laughs> right, Batman, hit it. <laughs> At a boy. Fielder, catch it. <laughs> <laughs> Well done for getting him out, Dennis. Marvellous play. <sighs> Dennis, how come you're out already? Awful. Two laps round the field for you. <sighs> well, Dennis, poor Walter had to go home. Yes! Which means for the rest of the day, it's just you and me. No! Only kidding. Phew. Since all the other children have the cold, you're going to spend the rest of the day being taught by all the teachers in the school. At once. What? What's nine times ninety-nine? What's long and sticky? What is the meaning of life? <laughs> what is this a square? <laughs> Oh, the worst day ever, Nasha. Teachers. Teachers everywhere. It's not fair. Why can't I catch a cold like everyone else? <gasps> Actually, I think I can. <laughs> oh, the light. It grows faint. Is that you, Mother? This awful cold. It's so horrible. So painful.
painful. And so very, very real. Goodbye, old friend. <laughs> Dennis. Dennis, could you move away from the door? I have to pick up B. Mum, I have a cold. No, you want out of school, like when you said you had chicken pox. <laughs> Or when you said you were pregnant. Or when you said your arm fell off. Unless you really have a cold like your dad, don't waste my time. Dad has a cold? Yes, and apparently it's very infectious, so keep far, far away from him. Hmm. Hi, Dad! Dad. Dad. Oh, oh. Calm down, Dad. I'm here to look after you. Bacon sandwich? Oh, lovely, Dennis. How nice of you. <coughs> What's in this sandwich? Bacon, bread, tomato sauce. Oh! <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> Oops. Water. <laughs> Right, need a plan B. What does it Gran says? Hey, Dennis, you want to see me get a whole coconut into my mouth? Ow. No, not that. Keep out of the cold and wet or you will catch a cold, I bet. Now, watch me get this coconut into my mouth. <laughs> oh, what, oh, what? Oh, oh. Hmm. Ta -ta -ta! He's fine. Nothing broken. Oh, are you sure? I definitely felt something snap. Maybe I should stay at home, rest the foot, get my strength back. No, you won't need to miss a day of school. <laughs> what? What kind of a doctor are you? Bye, face. Curly. Hey, Dennis. You OK? No, I'm not. Well, yes, I, I am. <sighs> Back to school. Great, cos we're all going to the beach. What? Yeah, as everyone has just gotten over their colds, their teachers thought we should have a day out. Brilliant! I love school! <laughs> this is going to be the best day ever! Ah. Ah. Gotcha. Oh dear, the Beano Town cold. Best get you home. No, no, that sneeze was a fluke. Gotcha. So was that one. Gotcha. And that one. Mum, I'm well. Oh, I feel great. Oh, honestly, Mum, I'm fine. I'm completely... Oh, Dennis. Stat. 
fake puke, plastic or rubber? Plastic. Pepperonis, please. Deep filled, extra everything. <laughs> Pizza's off. Huh? Walter? Where's good old Brenda? Oh, good old Brenda will be absent for a few days. As a consequence, the headmaster has afforded me the opportunity to elevate nutritional standards at our beloved school. Huh? Pizza's off. <laughs> Two bits of lettuce and a broad bean. I don't even like broad beans. Who does, Curly? Another pie crumb, anyone? Look at us. Scavenging in school bags for scraps. Oh, breadstick. <laughs> oh, oh, pencil. Kids like us need real food. And if we got to make with some serious menacing to get it, that's an added bonus. So there I was, <laughs> helping the family of hedgehogs across the autobahn. But with my nutritionally balanced menu, pupils will benefit from an immediate improvement. Do your worst, B. <laughs> Along with a 9% reduction in their tendency to be irritating, smelly little oiks. Yeah! <laughs> 9%? <laughs> you are clever, Walter. <laughs> Come, sir. Observe. He... he fired you? No. He threw up in my chef's hat, then he fired me. And goodness knows who will get to do tomorrow's school lunch. Hello, sir. My Auntie Beryl does catering. Nutritious, delicious dinners? Yeah, why not give her a call? Bye! Hello? Yes, this is Auntie Beryl's catering service. Let's go serve up some fun. <laughs> We're running out of mash. <laughs> sir, sir, those dinner ladies, they're imposters. It's Dennis. What? Don't be so silly, Walter. It's his Auntie Beryl. But, sir, look. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. One of them is a dog. Oh, Walter, I'm so sorry, Mrs. Um... Nasha, Nasha, Nash. Ah, yes, uh, Mrs. Um, Nasha, Nasha, Nash. Walter, lots of elderly ladies grow a few whiskers. Don't be so rude. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Walter's head was gonna explode. Uh, hi, Auntie Beryl's catering here. Tomorrow's order is six bags of potatoes. Oh, gee, that ball, a family reunion. 40 packs of fish fingers, 50 large pies. 150 very large. Make that 150 very large pies. And 227 sausages. Nash. Sorry, 228. Thank you. Hello? This is Auntie Beryl's catering again. I'd like to change tomorrow's lunch order. What? There's been a mistake! No mistake, doll. Two tons of ice cream in one unfeasibly giant scoop. Ta-da! <laughs> Excellent. Hello? Uh, uh, hello? Auntie Beryl? I've just had today's lunch order. Two tons of ice cream. Ice cream? No, 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 no ice cream here. Not a single scoop. I'm coming right over. And what 
What's all this about? <laughs> Half a ton of live lobsters? My face? Diversion, if you please. Hello. Have you met Paul the potato? He's having his nap. <laughs> Please tell me we are not selling cans of raspberry rocket! Yes. That stuff's full of sugar! Kids go hyper! Good hyper or bad hyper? Disaster hyper! Um, everyone, whatever you do, do not under any circumstances drink this! <laughs> Get rid of this stuff! OK, see ya! Curly, I didn't order any of those things! OK, I'm back! You get rid of it? Yeah! Where? Oh, I dumped it in that big bin with a picture of a lobster on it! Cool! Now! You what?! Sorry to trouble you again, Auntie Beryl, but uh, the school food inspector has turned up. Uh, he wants to, um... What is it you want to do again? Inspect the school food, obviously. Everything is all right, isn't it? <laughs> yes! Everything's fine! <laughs> Curly, Nasha, you've got to delay this inspector guy! <laughs> OK. All we got to do is calm everyone down and get rid of an army of hyper lobsters. Can't be that hard. Listen up, you lot! Everybody got to chill right now or else... Well, she's not our usual dinner lady, but... Herbal tea. Brilliant, eh? Now... We just need to... Sorry. All gone. Uh-oh. <laughs> and then there's Mrs. Nasha, Nasha, Nash. Lovely lady, but don't mention the beer. <laughs> Golly, hello, Mrs. Creature. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Plan D and G it is. Just change suck to blow. This ought to cool everyone down. Water? Disguise? Rubbish. Timing? Perfect. Walter! I can explain! Uh, no, no, I can't. Two lettuce leaves and a broad bean? Next! Great to have you back, Brenda. Nice. 